Hey there friends, welcome to episode 4 of my Kingdoms Reborn gameplay series. I'm Icon and today we're gonna continue to expand into iron production over here. I hope I'll be able to get that uh, brickworks and uh, um, pottery into motion here and uh, yeah, let's see what'll happen. We have a few beautiful projects going, it's spring uh, soon so let's speed up things a bit. This place is growing really nicely and um, for now I feel like we're in a really really good spot. At the end of winter my uh, production is uh, this um, high, so um, here we see I produce 1,000 units of food more than I um, consume. That's a really, really good thing. Also, my medicinal herb production is... Uh, well, I want more than that. So steel tools, I want to have those uh, soon as well. That's why we already went with a blacksmith card. I have no clue what will happen if I don't have uh, steel tools, but I'm pretty sure it's bad. It's always bad to have something like to uh, like tools not available. So let's uh, slap down a few more houses here. I noticed the uh, high fertility radius here, so I don't want to use houses for that. And um, yeah, so many things to do. I like that. Sustainability book. Mm, I wonder where I would want to use that actually. I, I should put it into something here sooner or later. The furniture workshop is uh, less and less interesting. The charcoal burner is already um, uh, here. Three immigrants want to join. Yeah, we're gonna take them up. Uh, no, we're, we're gonna pick them up. So, beekeeper, library, trading port. No, 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 no. No. So, what I really would like to have is uh, a new um, spot where I can harvest some healing, uh, some medicinal herbs. Because I really feel uh, nervous with uh, such a low amount of these available. Alright, so down here, well, I just wonder, do I want to go over here or over here? Let's say I'll, uh, I'll go over here. So I'm gonna claim this province with my influence. really like that new uh, option. And uh, we're gonna drop a bridge here. Control T to uh, make sure we're gonna be able to see where we're building. And let's see how the uh, fertility uh, looks like here. All right, this is perfect. This is a really good uh, spot for um, my healing, for my medicinal herbs to grow. There we go. Combo level three. My happy farms. There we go. So, let's check out what's happening here. The beer brewery already has a uh, um, increased efficiency. I'm gonna claim uh, the next province here right away. Because I feel like um, I want to um, install the um, advanced wheat um, production or wheat manufactory or however we want to call it because I feel like uh, I want to get rid of these items in my inventory you know all right so we already no uh, noticed the windmill uh, is perfectly fine here so I'm gonna put up the bakery here what happened with the coal mine, though? So I didn't do that at all. Interesting. Alright, so that's that. And, uh... Yet another pig ranch was something I had in my mind. Let's check that out. Um... I wish I could bring up a fertility overlay whenever I want to, because, uh... For example, here... This is just awesome because this is mostly uh, 
bad terrain for uh, agricultural um, purposes. It's really good to know that beforehand. So I'm massively overproducing here, I know that, but I don't ma mind at all. So let's see how uh, horrible this strategy goes. Because uh, what I really do a lot here in this game is I just slap storage yards wherever they, uh, wherever I feel like uh, I want to. And I can't imagine that this is uh, going to be uh, a good strategy um, in the long run, but we're gonna see. Maybe I'm wrong, maybe it's great. So, let's trade. Um, I can finally trade 300 per unit, so let's... Uh, Let's sell away 300 mushrooms. And now I finished that uh, quest here and I got the Companies Act, reducing the fees for trading companies. Well, since my town hall is already fully uh, stocked up, I can't do much there. So let's check out what happened uh, in that area here. So, uh, well. This town is uh, growing into some uh, really large dimensions at this point. I really like the, what I see here. Alright. Brickworks, Forester, Desert Pilgrim, yeah. I really start considering uh, that with all this uh, desert area up here. Could be really a good option in the long run. Sell food. Oh yeah, I want that. I have so much food. Let's do that. Bang, 4,000 now. I want to upgrade my uh, town hall at this point. So this area here will uh, always stay the uh, wood economy for our town. I'm gonna produce food over here. Well, in the long run it's gonna be a little bit annoying because I can't transport the food over here that well due to the mountains. But in my uh, in my um, fantasy right now, uh, this area here will support this area here food-wise. So, and uh, well, I do want a some sort of uh, real city core and I'm really considering to build that here into the desert. This uh, extra gold card uh, brought me up with that idea, so. Maybe it's gonna be horrible, maybe it's gonna be great, who knows, we're gonna try that out. So, let's um, set up two houses here too. Just wanna make sure that uh, wherever um, I'm building there's some sort of uh, opportunity for people to live uh, there. So we have uh, discovered a new era. Yay, new buildings. Frugality book, sustainability book. Well, it's the same old, same old. Let's uh, stick with those. So wild card, agriculture wild cards. Card removal card. <laughs> okay, so what can we research now? Trading company, automatically trade resources with world market at lower fees. Automatically, that's the point here I like to see. Market, provide food, fuel, medicine, tools, luxury to houses within radius. Bring far away resources in 50 units bulk. Logistics, trading post on desert, minus. Medicine maker, oh yeah. That's the building which uh, processes your medicine. Sheep or um, source for wool and uh, shallow water embark allows claiming bordering provinces across a body of water. I don't need that. Uh, I want to start with the with the market because I feel like uh, these uh, logistical buildings sound to me like very very important uh, buildings. Oh, we're out of. Uh, workers again, oh, that old story again. All my uh, crazy uh, expansionary, uh, expansionistic plans are now again a problem. So let's focus the immigration offices and, uh, oops, don't want to do that. And let's keep going. Let's 
so caravan has arrived. Well, I don't know why I should want to trade with them, uh -uh, honestly. So let's see. What what are these new cards? Build an unlocked agriculture building of your choice. Sick. That's really cool. That's really good. I like that. Archer Barracks. Oh uh, yeah, I wanted to have one of those. Since uh, we're overproducing wood that massively. Um, I want to do this. One Archer Barracks should be uh, available here. We're playing in, It's a medieval world after all, you know. So right now I don't really want to sell off any of these... Uh, foodstuffs here just in case we might be needing some so what could I sell though furniture is uh, really on a uh, stockpiling at this point but well for now I want to uh, slow down because uh, the situation here is not really that good simple reason I'm lacking workers so I'm um, already uh, whipped up the uh, immigration offices again and uh, hopefully we're gonna receive a new, few new units of population here so let's check out those new cards oh yeah immigration advertisement uh, remove a card from the draw deck does that mean I can't just remove it once and for all? I mean, sure, with those wild cards, I don't need uh, a lot of things anymore. So, but I really want to have the upgrade here. Warehouse sharing is caring. Set delivery target. You can set the storage market where the building's output will be stored. So I can now... Uh... I see. I want a warehouse, but I can't afford it right now. So, um, well, I don't want that company's act card, honestly. Oh, the books uh, do stay, uh, to do stack. That's good. All right. So, since I uh, have um, builders again, I don't need to. Uh, go for the immigration office and anymore. I mean, people are leaving town because they are homeless. That's uh, quite sad because that doesn't uh, really um, happen anymore. So now I can set delivery targets. I really don't understand, dear developers. If any of you sees, sees this, why? Why do we get this option that late? Please give it to me at the beginning of the game because this is just... Uh, um, my sentiment here is uh, quite simple. Having this option available from the scratch makes it so much easier to build an optimized and uh, well thought through uh, logistics network. Not knowing that this uh, option will show up made me build a uh, real messy thing that I don't uh, like too much. All right, but I know that now and next uh, town I'll know that too. But uh, Give 100 wheat to, tar to the target player. All right. So that's one thing. One card I would uh, actually like to remove. Um, what I want tried to say here before the card interrupted me um, was that I, I don't really see the reason to uh, lock that behind a town hall level because uh, it's not really it's not really some some game changer. It's just. Uh, some option of uh, managing your town and uh, in this game it's better to uh, plan large from scratch you know okay. well early access I don't take that too uh, too hard here but uh, I'm really surprised about this decision that's all I wanted to say with that yay Archie barracks so uh, they're gonna gonna slap a sustainability book on those, just uh, just like that. Why not? All right. So uh, what about stone? We produce one hundred and eighty of that stuff yearly. That's uh, the quarry here. 
So, let's see. Um, upgrade wide shaft. Oh, yeah. Alright, so, but this gives me the option of uh, optimizing my, um, my logistics, at least in the future. If nothing else, at least in the future. Coal treatment. No, I'm not interested in that. Extra immigrants. I can't really hold them right now. Um, I want to try out one of those new warehouses or markets. Well, the market is in research right now. Um, gonna be discovered soonish. Okay, production or uh, construction of things is proceeding rather slowly, but that's uh, not really an issue here. And uh, spring. Because right now I've laid down so many plans uh, that it's uh, perfectly fine to just wait out until uh, things are being done. So I have no uh, builders again. So during winter I had builders and uh, I guess that's because of the farm work. But that's gonna be okay. The most important farms are these. The other farms are, uh, well, okay. Not unimportant, but uh, not overly important either. So let's see. Now would be a good uh, moment to uh, bring up um, some immigration uh, card. But, well, can I redraw that one more time? 20 gold? Come on, that's a uh, kidnap. Ooh, why not? The uh, the devs said that the AI is useless, so um, there we go. This should alleviate my problem uh, somewhat, but only not really. So let's see, Desert Pilgrim. Gonna get that card later. It's uh, growing more and more costly to do that, but uh, what should I spend my money uh, on else, you know? I really need people right now, and it would save time. Anyways, didn't really work out as intended, sadly. Ah, the immigration offices are doing their jobs now too, but uh, oh my god. I guess I have to uh, force uh, uh, force builders now into jobs because that doesn't work otherwise. Oh yeah, there's another kidnapping. Your town is mine. Yum. <laughs> so with some extra builders, uh, I should be easily able to bring up houses soon. Let's do this, and let's disable the, the immigration offices. Alright. The most important part for me is to end the homelessness as soon as possible. Oh yeah, so markets are now researched. The next step to me is the medicine maker. Yes please, I want a market card. So um, let's see, wow that radius is small. I really expected a larger radius, but whatever. It covers uh, the houses here and... Uh, unlock vassalization. You can now vassalize another city with influence points. To vassalize another city, click on the town hall, your vassal city, keep the control, but you but must pay vassal tax to What, what the tooltip? What? No, 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 no. I don't want to attack them. I, I, I actually wanted to... Okay, let's... Uh... Let's attack them then. Reinforce. Uh, what? So let's check that out. I, I seem to win this uh, brutally. So I feel like declaring war on my neighbors should be something that uh, I'd like to see uh, prompted behind a... Do you really want to do that? Just as I thought. Advanced storage with 30 storage slots. So that's what a warehouse is for. I see. So they are uh, the bigger cousins of uh, storage um, thingies. Oh my god, they're huge. 
Okay. Nice. So we're gonna bring that up here because I didn't find time yet to uh, create um, storage yards uh, back there. So, okay. So the housing issue has been already uh, resolved. So let's uh, keep going here. Maybe it's actually better to uh, manipulate these numbers manually, but uh, right now I really want to see more people in jobs. Icon has conquered Stark. So now they are my vessels. Great. Um, Lord diplomat, Lord Icon. Um, declare friendship. So, you befriended us, plus 10. They like me more now. Yeah, okay, so I guess that's, uh, that's something which we will see in the future. That doesn't look like it's uh, implemented yet at all. So, let's check out. These bad boys here need coal. Um... Yeah, the coal deposit was uh, living next door here. So let's claim that province and uh, slap down a coal mine there. Because that seems to be in order. Also, I'd say we, we could use a warehouse here too. Immigration advertisement. Yes, please. Bang. I have the housing right now, so I just want to go crazy and uh, pick up those folks while I can. Um, I need now uh, another warehouse. Wait a sec. Um, let's check. Let's try that out. Industry wildcard. Does that uh, include warehouses? No, but I'm gonna keep that one nevertheless. So, the tailor will be uh, useful once I started, once I have the sheep production going, but before that, not really. So, uh, I'll rather wait now un until a new warehouse might uh, show up, because I I'm, right now I'm, I I'm a tad bit broke, you know. Produce pottery. Um, why doesn't that work out at all? I guess. Well, now it's working. I think most of the time, uh, many of these buildings were completely um, unmanned, and therefore a lot of uh, work steps can't be uh, done here. So. Okay, we get in there. But I really seem to need more uh, workers here. And more houses, obviously. So, agriculture wildcard. That's not necessarily what I want to have. Industry, that didn't work out either. Mine, also not what I want to have. But a, uh, well. Oh, look at that. So my food consumption severely uh, increased during the last year. So. I just want a service wildcard. I think that should be what I, uh, what would, would work to, uh, for me. And another immigration uh, thingy should be uh, fine too. So, are you kidding me? I feel like the warehouse should be in the service wildcard. Oh, it's over 100th person, so rare card price. Happy Bread Day. Homebrew. Houses with pottery. Receive plus science, I want that. That's good. Your tools count is low. If you run out of tools, your citizens' uh, work efficiency will drop. The easiest way to acquire tools is by importing steel tools from... Yeah, okay. So, uh, actually, sounds like a pretty smart idea to uh, buy some steel tools. 
until I'm able to... Uh, how many do we consume per year, actually? 45. So maybe need to wait out until I uh, have more money. We're, we're gonna produce those uh, soon um, by, on, by ourselves, but... Uh, I don't have any uh, people working there yet. But we're gonna get there. So, um, let's automate this again. I feel like uh, it will work out now. Alright, nice. So those warehouse carts are really, really uh, rare, gotta say. I can't really right now spend too much money there because I need to uh, buy a few uh, tools until the situation is uh, back to normal. So there we go. It also takes quite some time until uh, your uh, delivery is uh, here, three minutes. It's a whole season basically, so. But the good news here is uh, my population is large enough to um, to get all the jobs done that I've laid down, so ultimately we should be able to even things out. But uh, I think uh, once all this is uh, done and such, need more tools, yeah. Um, we will slow down a bit and gather up you know downgrade houses are downgraded why did I lose housing capacity our upgraded houses uh, sporting more people obviously yes okay so um, I don't understand uh, the connection between um, houses sporting. Uh... Yeah, let's take those immigrants for now. That's uh, workforce. Um, I don't see the the uh, connection between tools and uh, the capacity of housing there. But well, we're gonna get there. There is finally the warehouse I was looking for. But I'm not gonna uh, build that right now. All right, so we will receive tools in a moment. Can you please stop clattering with that cowbell? <laughs> okay, so turns out I'll need a lot more uh, tools and uh, we produce... Yeah, that's, uh, homeless. Yeah, why? We have tools again. Whatever. They're gonna get there. Hmm, well right now I'm a little bit uh, low on money and it uh, looks like, uh, oh, it's one of those uh, uncomfortable situations, so uh, I already know what to do with this. I'm going to, going to sell out a lot of uh, things here, and let's see, um, going to trade in now a lot of uh, steel tools, that's... Uh, we went into a uh, cycle of doom here because uh, it's one of those silly things that happens sometimes in games when uh, your your people are. Uh... Oh, I don't. I want to keep that. Let's uh, let's wait for a moment. So what's happening right now is uh, everybody's trying to grab tools because everybody needs a tool now and therefore uh, for some wild reason the yearly consumption ratio is happening all at once. Which is bad, because that's uh, that's not how these games should work. But, um, well, I forgive an early access uh, these little kinks. Because that's... Uh, the game did that to me with medicinal uh, supplies uh, before already, um, before that already too. And I had that similar problem. Once one of these stockpiles uh, runs out, somehow um, this game really spirals out of control and does a lot of shenanigans. So my whole mistake here was uh, to assume that the blacksmith would be uh, finished before my tools run out. But uh, I'll learn out of that 
and uh, I don't know. I, uh, I disagree with the with the game here, but next time uh, we're gonna be on this uh, series, there's gonna be um, enough steel tools for an entire year, and then we're gonna see where things will be uh, will be at then. Alrighty, thanks for watching. Feel free to drop a comment down below, leave a like, leave a subscribe. I'd be more than happy about that. And next episode, we're gonna stabilize this town and uh, have some more fun with that. See you soon. Bye bye.